All right, so I'm not even quite sure what this video is, Chavez Slovakia. This is living memes react to their living meme status. I don't, I'm not really even sure what this means. I don't know if this is the person the meme is about hearing about them being a meme. You know what I mean? Or, 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 or what? So let's check this out. I don't know. It's by constant throwing. If this is not good, it doesn't come out. If it is, then you see it. It's about that simple. And let's see. I don't, uh, I don't know. Uh, every election throws up something new. And this one has thrown up something called a dank meme. Uh, according to the website, <laughs> Know Your Meme, and the, there is such a thing as a, a, a website called that, a dank meme is uh, one that's intentionally bad or bizarre, an ironic expression used to mock yeah. Online viral media and in jokes that have exhausted their comedic value. Uh, right. And this, uh, that we just saw was a dank meme put up by the AMWU against the Prime Minister. So watch your dank memes. And dry drunks in the same morning. Yeah. You're going well. <laughs> oh, so this is the guy. I'm not sure if you're aware of how big an internet meme. So these are people reacting to memes about themselves. This is gold you are and I'm curious how you feel about that and all of those pictures out there yeah it's incredible you know and, and I, I constantly get it from the kids who I when I'm walking my dog on the common look at this meme look at that you know people are just coming up and showing me all these amazing things on the internet I think it's lovely I think it's perhaps because I've connected with people over the years I've made them feel happy and when you look at a little picture like that you know maybe you just want to smile Hey, give him that dick me smile! Get nervous smile. every time you pick up a pepper grinder now, people. <laughs> no, I never get nervous. Life's about enjoying it, you know. And, what? Uh, no, He's so nervous. cool about it, cause the memes about him are weird, fam. They are really fucking weird. So that's what's up, dude. Busy dancing, and I might be dancing on a beach in Spain soon. So watch this space. Yeah. Oh. So what do you think about that? Humongous. Saint Humongous. That's Saint a curly Humongous. Dick. What do you think? I think that is just absolutely hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> These people are this so cool entitled, about their memes, that man. That face when you're about to drop the hottest dad joke of 2016. <laughs> <laughs> and let me, and would you believe it if I told you that image has 140,000 views? That one there? Yeah. That's amazing. He's like, he's like, I don't, I'm famous and I don't even know about people. it. Uh, uh, lately, Infowars.com unexpectedly has been seeing some of the biggest traffic in our history yeah. from a new source. Not Drudge Report, not our daily AM and FM audience, not Facebook, not Twitter, not YouTube. Those are all huge sources. Those are all our top sources. And I guess articles are being written about it. It's being marveled about. I, I, I wasn't aware of it. Is marveled about the words you would use to describe what we're doing to Last you? Last week, Buckley ran up and said, look at this. Look at these sites. These are meme sites. These are things I've been visiting for years. <laughs> this is something Generation X right down to Millennial. <laughs> look at his face. Like, you were... <laughs> I'm aware of the big sites. Reddit and others have it, but I, I don't really follow it. Even obviously. In the last two weeks, we've had most of the top memes because our listeners are going and getting clips from idiots on the show and clips from anti-trump people and going and making memes out of them and, is and that is that what they told you we're doing because that's not what Wars we're doing many of the top memes we're not fair we should do a report on it we haven't even really <laughs> talked about it yet because it's so we're definitely not fans of you bro you need to revisit the memes about you over the top the finest mother's milk to the meme makers who by the way are not conservative they're not libertarian they're not they're just into entertainment is that and I yeah don't know how we hit the zeitgeist here but we've now hit the zeitgeist of memes is that what it is the zeitgeist of memes bro i think he's trying to meme us while talking about his memes you're also very popular in meme culture. Yeah. <laughs> Have you seen the videos where they like do your ad lib and they like make it from you into a sprinkler? Okay, <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's it was fine. That was fine. Hell yeah, hell yeah. I love that video. I love that video.
Okay, well, he fucks with it. like everything that I you... I love that. I heard that. I love that. I mean, I lo yeah, Please. I love it because I'm me, you know? Like, so I'm able... I don't take myself too serious. And, and Big Boy knows that. Like, I, from day one, we've always had a great rapport. Yes, sir. I hope, he can, I hope he can attest to the fact that I haven't, like, changed or altered who I was from the first moment I walked in. Not at all. Walked in here to, the, to, to now, you know? And okay. I, I feel like with that comfort comes, like, the ability to be able to laugh at yourself, too. And, like, I see all right. terrible, funny pictures of Big Boy all the time, and yes. I laugh hysterically. <laughs> I'm trying to get my mean game up. You know what I'm saying? Shoot, on the real, man, my kids are in private school and I'm telling them they only got one more semester. Yeah, get your bro. I'm got these people are so cool about these memes about you. I did not know they were going to take this so well. Get my mean game up. I remember, man, you was popping up everywhere. The Buddhist temple. Oh yeah, no, it was great. The Dada, the Dada memes. Love that one. Now, now people probably out there. Oh my God, he recognized it. He's paying attention to it. He sees our memes. Come on. I'm out here, man. I'm, I'm out here. With How would you like, not, not see I'm these not memes? I'm gonna pretend though. like I don't know what's going on. You know, that's why like I post them on Instagram. I post funny pictures of myself too, even from like the Degrassi days. Like I'm not scared of that. Like I hope you all know that I used to like look mad, awkward with like a weird haircut In with no wheelchair. lineup. Oh my God! Okay, let's see it. Okay, take his hat off. <laughs> you get fucking get memed with yourself. How does that feel? <laughs> Thank you, Internet, again. Get mean with yourself, John what Cena. What kind of new precedent do you think uh, nice. new technologies present to performance? Because it seems to me like maybe YouTube caught you by surprise. And I was just wondering what you, you know, uh, <coughs> think yes. about... Aaron's got a little thing to tell us here, but he's not telling it. Right, I put up about 60 performances of mine on my website, and you have to choose your platform. So I chose YouTube. Okay. I hadn't quite figure down. This is the bit I didn't realize. Is that when you put things on YouTube? Yeah. I thought somehow or other the access was via my website. Then I discovered, oh no, you could get to it via no. YouTube. No. You get to it you to YouTube. Okay, this is about four years ago, three years ago. So I'm just figuring this out. And then not oh, only God. people can get it on YouTube, they can then take it and chop it up and yeah. turn it into something else. So if you've done a poem called The Babysitter. Some teenage guys in America call it the baby. <laughs> and if they've got the Michael Rosen rap, they can, not so funny, call it the Michael Rosen. <laughs> uh, and if you've got, uh, I don't know, any kind of, So meanwhile, out there in America, I have become a cult. <laughs> or yeah. teenage <laughs> Teenage <laughs> to turn my poems into sort of things about. Wait, he doesn't like it. Like so there's this whole kind of scene like thing it. where they've taken my poems, made them utterly obscene, and then, idiot me, what did I try and do? Pull them down. I tried to take oh, them down. Oh no. Well, hang on, there's a copyright issue. Gold pompous. They're my poems. My son shot the poems. I spent the money to do it. How dare they? So what I did was I let YouTube know. And YouTube said, that's all right. What you do is you just simply say they've breached copyright. Oh, what you no. do is you write to these, whatever you do, you, you'll know, you go to their URL. He right dropped copyright videos. strikes on people for his fucking memes? What the fuck? And you basically ban them. Boy, did the proverbial hit the fan. My word. At that point, they went bananas. One guy, I think it may still be there, he said, he, he filmed himself saying, I got a statement to make to Michael Rosen, and he's sitting there, you know, you can see he's in his glasses in his, in his room. Um, and he's sitting there, and he's got another guy put up like a manifesto against Michael Rosen, you know, and so on. And I kind of, um, I started getting into email correspondence with them. And one of them said quite directly, he said, well, I said, look, the problem is, is that kids think I'm a poet. I've, I've got any objection to obscenities, all right? Liberal about it. The problem is, is that kids are accessing the stuff they put on the computer, they put in microwaves, and up comes the. <laughs> 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 
I mean, you know, it's all right by me. I can sort of live with it, but I'm getting letters from parents going, are you aware? <laughs> and of course they think possibly it's me doing it, you see. So back come the guys in Pennsylvania. Um, why Pennsylvania? I don't know, my cousin was there. But anyway, um, back they come saying, well, that's not our fault. That's the fault was their parents letting them surf the net. At which point I had no answer. Right. And I said, yeah. I mean, if you've got a problem, I mean, if you let a 10 year old surf the net, you will see the most god awful stuff out there. So I said, fair dues, guys. At which point I suddenly became, you know, even more of a massive hero <laughs> for the Pennsylvania. <laughs> Now, right there with these guys. And, uh, oh no! Get emails from Zorg and Imperial Lobster. Imperial and they go, Lobster. Just found up another one that makes you look like your anyway. It's really good, you know. And they go, "What do you think?" And I, I don't even answer. And then, uh, "Happy birthday, Mike!" And then they quote lines from the poems at me, which they've screwed up. Do you see what I mean? You know. Uh, <laughs> um, right. That's so good. Just press red. Do you okay. want to say when to stop? Um, it's cool. So, uh, Michael, yeah. what have you got to say to your millions of YouTube fans? Hi, poopers. It's so wonderful what you've done with all my YouTube performances. I'm so grateful to you. It's yeah. Been so well, that's to good. See my face turned into <laughs> and all those words chopped up. I love you, poopers. I love you. Swag, bro. Yeah, yeah dude. You don't Hell yeah. Get what you expect. Swag. Because you become an internet sensation. Oh my god, so I yes. I'm going to show you some of these memes and get your reaction. Have you okay. seen these? No, I haven't seen these. Okay, so okay. this one. Uh, my name is Morgan Freeman, and, and okay. you're reading this with my voice? <laughs> He's so. He's so confused. Let me keep you. What's your reaction to do? Just think about the voice. You know, <laughs> it's old. Yeah, he's right, you know. <laughs> he who. Okay, you did not give these any context. God damn it, media. You gotta give them context for the funny. Jesus. Is it funny to hear that to counseling people are just telling you you're the voice Bitch, of Bitch, you're not doing this is well. Is it weird still, or are you kind of just used to it? Yeah, you're used to it, you know, it's, it's an everyday thing now, yeah. so, and, and I'm not the voice of God, I know that, so, I mean, if I go around thinking that, then I'm in trouble. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, in case reading this in my voice helps, you can always be a reason, you can always be a reason why the day is brighter. Well, that's the best part of that whole yeah. paragraph. Thank you okay. so much, Morgan. <laughs> All right. Congratulations. I was fucking weak. God damn it, can you find somebody better to do this? You didn't give, the first off, those memes are shit. Those aren't even the best Morgan Freeman memes. God Thank damn you, it. Good, good to see you. Now the next time he sees it's gonna be ruined. Oh, please, God. It's a global popularity with the Rick yeah, Rolling yeah, phenomenon. Yeah, it's pretty weird, that. Now, <laughs> I guess for those people who don't remember or don't know what that was, it was basically they, on the Everybody internet, thousands of links have been rolling. altered so that when you clicked on them, yeah. it went to your music video. Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, and, and then it just went massive and you won an award at the MTV Awards. Yeah, well, that, I think what happened was because that thing kind of, um, you know, it had, its, had its 15 minutes and it was pretty massive kind of thing, especially in the States, I think, especially. Mm. Um, um, uh, it was a bit strange and a few things happened on the internet because of that <laughs> bit that were pretty weird and one, of, one was which the MTV had this award for the best act ever and uh, they threw me in that category which I thought was you know then being ironic and funny um, but I think that the <laughs> European public thought it was ironic and funny to vote for me. Yeah. Um, so they did. And, uh, and I won. But I didn't go and collect the award because uh, Sir Paul McCartney was going to be there. And it was in Liverpool that time. and. Um, and Bono was there, I think, giving him the award. And I just thought it would just be ridiculous. I mean, it was ridiculous <laughs> anyway. Oh, it would have been great. No, uh, no I, uh, yeah, that definitely. But I just thought the whole thing of accepting an award. I mean, I think I got something like 900 million votes. And I'm not sure there's that wow. many people in Europe, you see. So I think someone was pulling strings <laughs> right, somewhere. There might have been some more internet yeah. trickery but, going on there. But that's one of the awards. I don't have many of them, to be honest. Or gold discs anywhere in the house or anything like that. Just because I think my mum's got them all and other yeah. members of the family. They're not all on your mum's It's pretty that, good th one, That though. one I've got because it wobbles and it's quite good on the sideboard. <laughs> oh, it's the one with Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. a cool one. So okay. Quite, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, okay, then. I can't tell. His I was trying to gauge his reaction to that. I couldn't tell if he really liked being a meme or not. 
it looked like he didn't think it was really legit how he got voted for. But, you know, if I would have known he was up for an award, I would change my IP address to vote for him to make it seem like I'm in the right place. So he would win. So maybe he has a point there. That was pretty good. Morgan Freeman went irritates me. He didn't pick good memes. That that writer is really good about it. Retracted that strike. Um, so then we can make YouTube poops of his of this stuff. I'm gonna find a, a good YouTube poop then of his poems uh, because we've really only seen the one meme of him over and over again. So I'd like to see more if there's more out there. I'm pretty sure there's got to be a part two of this, right? Let's check him out, man. This was by uh, Constant Throwing. It's a great video, man. I'll see you on the next one, dude. Peace. That was so good. Wow. Crocs. 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 Crocs, 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 Crocs. I'm rocking Crocs. I'm rocking Crocs. I'm rocking Crocs. Wearing Crocs, boy. I'm rocking Crocs. I'm rocking Crocs. I'm rocking Crocs. Wearing Crocs, boy. My Crocs are gold. My pops is old. My Crocs got soul. My Crocs are bold. I go to church wearing Crocs. I'm always turned wearing Crocs. My Crocs are great. Your Crocs are lame. With my Crocs, I can cross a lake. Crocs, 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 Crocs. Crocs.